Happening tomorrow, city officials plan the design of the future Ocean Beach Pier. Thank you for joining us on this Friday night. I'm Phil Blauer. It's a new design for an old landmark that's been damaged after years of getting hit with a high surf, but there is still a long road ahead before we get this new pier. And our Kasha Gorchek joins us live right now from OB with a lot more on that. Kasha, good evening. Hey, good evening, Phil. From a very windy and cold OB tonight, uh, tomorrow will be the fourth in a series of workshops surrounding the Ocean Beach Pier Renewal Project. It had been recently narrowed down to a few designs, but tomorrow the city is expected to unveil the top choice based on community feedback. This is a once in a lifetime opportunity to be in on this designing the pier that's going to go there. Denny Knox is executive director at Ocean Beach Main Street Association and one of the original stakeholders in the community to try to find a path forward for the aging pier. Once it was determined the OB pier had reached the end of its life, the city called on people like Knox to form a task force. And making sure that we had as much input as possible and it's been very successful. They got other local residents involved in a series of workshops to help determine the design of a new pier. A lot wider, longer, it's definitely going to be taller. The current 57 year old pier has been the subject of frequent closures and damage, especially in recent years during high surf and storm events. Knox shared with us some of the other ideas community members hope to see in a reimagined pier. Interested in art, educational purposes, um, viewing areas, uh, having some shade on the pier, having a little bit more commercial activity to help support the uh, maintenance of the pier. The city plans to unveil the preferred design at a workshop this Saturday, teasing the big reveal in a social media post. When I showed you those three images. Yeah, I was surprised that they let the cat out of the bag in any way at all. Knox says she's sworn to secrecy, but she has seen the full plan and believes people will be very pleased. We were all sort of gobsmacked when we were watching the first presentation to our uh, task force. We were kind of like, wow. They really did listen to people. The design concept is the result of more than 3,000 surveys and more than 600 people attending previous workshops. We tried one last time to get any more details from Knox beyond what the city posted, but... My lips are sealed. She is certainly taking her role very seriously, but uh, this unveiling is just a few hours away tomorrow. That workshop is going to take place from 2 to 5 p.m. at the Liberty Station Conference Center. So Knox, along with everyone at the city, they're really encouraging all of these people, the hundreds who have participated in the input process to uh, show up tomorrow and, of course, hear what all their hard work has led to. And following that event, we're also told there's going to be a new online survey available for people to continue to provide their input on even more details on this pier, things like the lighting and, again, even more kind of really detailed um, things that are going to eventually be on this pier. It's still considered a potential replacement because it is still many years down the road with a lot of funding that still needs to happen. But of course, a lot of community interest out here and the very latest will be unveiled tomorrow. We're live in Ocean Beach tonight. Kasha Gregorczyk, Fox 5 News.